Welcome to another episode of the Mortgage Center Sky Financial Corporation's Success Tips, where Edmonton's top real estate agents learn proven secrets for success. This episode is brought to you by the Mortgage Center Sky Financial Corporation, the number one mortgage choice for Edmonton homebuyers. Now, here's your success tip. When you think of doubling your business in the next 12 months, what's the first thing that comes to mind? For most realtors, the first thing that comes to mind is that they're going to have to work longer and harder. In other words, earning more requires doing more. And frankly, that's true if you want to have a glorified job trading time for money, which as far as I'm concerned is the absolute worst way to make money. But if you want a real business that gives you freedom, flexibility, and fortune, you can't just work harder. You've got to work smarter. Sure, you could sacrifice your family, faith, and fitness in order to grind yourself to a higher income bracket. But why? Will that make you any happier? Reminds me of a great quote from the Dalai Lama when he was asked what surprises him about humanity. He responded by saying, he sacrifices his health in order to make money. Then he sacrifices money to recuperate his health. Then he is so anxious about the future that he does not enjoy the present. The result being that he does not live in the present or the future. He lives as if he's never going to die, and then he dies having never really lived. Dang, that is so true, is it not? So what if the secret to truly thriving as a realtor is not doing more, but doing less? Think about it. No matter what you want to accomplish, chances are there are just one, two, or three things that produce the lion's share of your results. Am I right? I call those the vital few the 20% of activities that produce 80% of your results. The problem with most realtors is that they get sucked into the vortex of the trivial many to the neglect of the vital few. And then they wonder why they're overworked and underpaid. (laughs) Wonder no longer. If you want to create extraordinary results, you can't afford to think like ordinary people think. You can't afford to major in the minors. You've got to transcend. With that in mind, here are three steps for crushing it with your vital few. Step number one, determine your vital few. Ask yourself this question, what are my top three most valuable activities? For example, here are a few high value activities worth considering. Number one, database marketing campaigns that maximize your repeat and referral business. Number two, referral partner campaigns that attract high value referral partners. And number three, systematizing operations so your business runs without you. Let's be real. How much time do you spend each week on those vital few? If you're like most realtors, not much. And that's precisely why most struggle just to eke out a meager existence. Step number two, block schedule your vital few. Losers find the time, winners make the time. As Tony Robbins says, if you talk about it, it's a dream. If you envision it, it's possible. But if you schedule it, it's real. Step number three, follow through on your vital few. Losers wait to feel motivated, then act. Winners act, then feel motivated. Here's the irony of life. If you do what's comfortable, life will be hard. But if you do what's hard, life will be comfortable. So there you have it. I've just given you three simple steps for creating a breakthrough in your business and in your life. For more information on how we can help you take your business to the next level, call us today. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of the Mortgage Center Sky Financial Corporation's Success Tips. If you have any questions or comments, please call us today at 780-483-5244.